Have you been as frustrated as I am that the step counter in Pikmin doesn't work? Like you see it counting up here, but once you go into your profile, the step counter just shows zero. Well, I have the perfect solution for you, and actually it's not the game Pikmin Bloom itself causing it. It is the silly app Google Fit causing this issue to happen. But of course, you have to enable all permissions for Pikmin Bloom. Let me show you how to fix that your step counter doesn't work in the game. Follow me. Okay, the first thing you have to do before we even start the Google app, my advice is simple. Let's go into the app settings of my phone. Click on the cogwheel icon on your Android device. Go all the way down to apps and notifications and you'll see fit. First, I highly recommend to clear the entire cache. Just clear everything from this app. I highly recommend uninstall the entire app. Reinstall it, get it in your phone. Now when that's done, make sure you go to advanced. On the advanced, you'll find something called battery. I would highly recommend you to click on don't optimize. Because once, once intelligent control or optimize kicks in, when your battery goes low, the app will stop counting steps and your calories. I, I, I would not recommend to rely on the calorie count of this app. It doesn't work. It's under calculating all the time. I mean, no healthy human burns 1,300 calories sitting down. That's already been proven, but that's another story. So make sure you click on don't optimize, go out, out of the app, or go out of here, make sure everything else is all right. And also make sure that the location is allowed and your physical activity, that it tracks all your physical activity. And remove permissions if app isn't used, make sure that is off. Of course, if that one is on and you're not using your app, it's not going to count steps for Pikmin Bloom. Right? Let me show you how the app works. Now we're going to go into Google Fit. There you see my awesome profile. <laughs> Let's see. Go into the cogwheel icon here. And now we are going to go to tracking preferences. Track your activities, put it on. Use the location data, put it on. I can show you how that works. So now I've put it off. Once I put it on, I'll get this menu up where it says use your location. Use location in the background to map your walks, runs and bike rides and get more accurate workout metrics. Fit will collect location data even when the app closed or not in use. So step one, allow fit to use location once or while using the app. That one has to go on. Step two, allow fit to use location all the time. Turn on now. Perfect. Now your app should be 100% ready to go and make sure that your app is tracking activities all time. So let's try walking around a bit. Do you know that the app is super slow and updating its steps. So sometimes he doesn't even update it real time. I don't know why I have not designed this app. But you will know that Pikmin will not work if the app stays on zero. And once you have the, this app installed, Pikmin will ask you if it can gain access to this. And you press, of course, yes. Now let's, let us go back into Pikmin to see if it works. I'm going to try to walk around a bit to see if it gets, if it counts. And there you see, the steps to go has gone down, the app is calculating as it should. Now if you aren't sure if Google Fit and the game is counting the apps properly, you can always minimize the app and double check. There you go, 14 steps in Google Fit. The app is working as intended. I hope you find this guide really useful and helpful and I hope it fixes your the frustrations you have with your Android device or with your OnePlus phone. I don't want, it's not the phone's fault, it's actually Google that has some ridiculous difficult ways how to enable permission and it can also be the blame of the battery management 
and how communicates with the Pikmin app. So those two go in hand in hand, and that's why Pikmin stops counting steps if Google Fit stops counting steps. All in all, I wish you happy hunting, get as many fruit as possible, enjoy growing your Pikmin army, and I will come back with some tips and tricks for the game next time. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you.